Welcome to This Day and Everything Cool for January 1st. On this day in 1989, the groundwork was laid for a whole new gaming franchise. The original SimCity began rolling out on different computer platforms like the Macintosh, MS-DOS, and Commodore Amiga, giving players the ability to build and manage their very own city. Lead designer Will Wright came up with the idea a few years earlier while working on the helicopter game Raid on Bungling Bay when he realized that he had more fun designing the levels and environments than he did playing the actual game. This eventually evolved into the idea of players being able to build and shape their own towns and cities with the ability to micromanage every little detail like power generation generation, transportation, and public services. To make things interesting, the game also had random natural disasters like tornadoes and earthquakes, which made your job even more challenging. All this gave a whole new dimension to the concept of strategy gameplay, and SimCity went on to become a major success, selling more than a million copies. SimCity made its console debut on the Super Nintendo in 1991, complete with new features like dynamic seasons. A full sequel, SimCity 2000, followed in 2003, and Will Wright and his company Maxis also created countless spin-offs like Sim Farm and Sim Ant. Electronic Arts bought Maxis and the rights to the Sim franchise in 1997 and have since continued the series with more new games like the life simulation game The Sims. A reboot of the main series, simply titled Sim City, was released in 2013. 